Oh, hi. Welcome to the Nerdy Fitness Vlog with your host, Pablo Gunner. And I am here to talk nerdy fitness to you. So nerdy things and fitness things and whatever things I feel like talking about. So, uh, for one, I finally got my Just Saiyan gear, which, uh, it's super expensive. I, I've been wanting to get some Just Saiyan gear for years, but it's super expensive. It's like 50 bucks a piece, and I was like, that is atrocious. It, it's not even licensed by, by Dragon Ball Z or, or Dragon Ball Super, whatever, you know? So I'm like, that's, that's ridiculous that you pay that much and it's not even licensed by them. So, and they're like, oh, well, that's because it's legit. It's better than, uh, it's better than Under Armour. And I'm like, eh, we'll see when I get it. And I'll be honest, I'm still not sure because I have a shirt that's similar like to this, but it's long sleeve. And I think it's almost the same material except my wife got it for me and it it's, was way cheaper than this. So, I'm not sure if it's, it's, if it's truly worth it yet. But I have a gray shirt that I think Under Armour shirt that I think I'm gonna wear under this, and then wear this, and I might make I might make a, a DBZ or DBS Dragon Ball Super Vegeta Blue cosplay out of it, and just and just do that. I would just need like the like what like gray legging pants or whatever and boots. But I I think I I have the boots, so it's all good. So yeah, uh, so that that would be that would be a cool thing to do. I like it when people like color their eyebrows. I really love that stuff when people color their eyebrows with it. Uh, I just don't want to have to style the wig. Like I'll either go to Just Cos Cosplay Supply and see if they can do it for me, or I'll just see if there's one on Amazon and see if they if they can do it. Which speaking of, I am an Amazon affiliate. So if you buy anything through the website. I get a little chunk of that. Like, it's not extra, I just get a little chunk. So that's nice. I might start buying my own stuff through my own links. Um, just just so I feel like somebody's contributing to this sinking ship. I, I just had an apple from a co-worker, uh, which was delicious. It was from uh, Chimayo, which I love Chimayo. I miss it. I miss it because my, uh, my grandma lived in Chimayo. I used to go there all the time in my young years my youth so I love it but uh yeah it was it was delicious so yeah and then uh so last night I did arms which was really great I stepped it up I used I tried to use 15 pound weights for as much of the arms workouts as I could uh I think the ones that I really didn't use the arm I didn't use the fifth pen 15 pound weights was some of the shoulder workouts and then maybe some of and then like the last bicep one but I, I also realized that like I need more because it's a really short workout. It ends up only being about 30, 40, like the actual workout itself, I think is about 30 minutes. And then like with the warm up and stretching and stuff, I think it maybe adds up to like uh, 40 or yeah, about 40 minutes. So I'm, I want to add more because I felt like our biceps need more as well. So I want to do that too. So I'm going to add more to that workout, but it was good. It's always awkward though, because I shower after I work out at work. I mean, it's awkward regardless, but it's, it's, it's awkward because like your arms are so stiff, like you can't get certain parts of your body well, and you're just like, Ugh. it's, it's just, it's, it's just weird and it's funny. So yeah, but, uh, but I love it. I love it. I, I just wish I would have done more done more all together so I need to add more and then leave sooner so I can have more time too because I would have but I didn't I was like oh my workout only takes about this long so I won't I won't bother with it so yeah so that's what I did last night and of course lifting weights I was freaking starving before uh, I had a burrito on the way to work a sausage egg and cheese burrito and then uh, yeah and then after like I said I was hungry but I wasn't able to eat right away because I had all these checks to do at work. So uh, it was a little while before I actually ate. I think it well, it was like a couple hours before I before I ate uh, after my workout because I was I was done around like 10, 15, and then I probably didn't eat until about like maybe uh, 12, 15. I want to say maybe. Yeah. So yeah, a couple hours. 
So, uh, and I had, um, uh, it was egg, cheese, and bacon bagel, but I just had half. And then I was still like kind of hungry and I was like, uh, I don't know if I should have another one, but I also had a cheese stick. So I had that one right as soon as, soon as I could. But yeah, and so I had the other half like a couple hours later because I got hungry sooner since I didn't have as big of a meal. And then I was like, oh man, I know I'm gonna work out this morning, but I don't know when my relief is gonna come because it's the weekend, so technically my relief should get there early because it's not that busy on the weekends. But that's not how it goes. So, because some people like to take their sweet ass time getting to where they're supposed to be. So, I love, I love how, I love how your coworkers are constantly fucking you over and it's like, we work together. So, you know, what comes around goes around, right? So, uh, yeah. Anyways, um, so, but yeah, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's just one of those things. Um, it's, it's like, it's understandable during the week because there's other things going on, but on the weekend it's like, there's really nothing holding you up except for you. I did eat, I had a yogurt. I had a blueberry yogurt and Noosa yogurt and it was very good, it was delicious, I love it. Uh, I had that around seven and I didn't, I didn't get to the gym until about 8.30, maybe a little later. And so um, I was feeling a little, I was hungry and I was feeling a little just tired and a little sluggish and today was my hardcore cardio day and I was like oh god I really don't want to do this because I know I'm freaking tired so but I was like I was freaking sluggish through the warm-up but then I started kicking it into gear when I started off and I was like okay okay this is feeling good that's another reason I love wearing stuff like this I love because it motivates me that's the other thing wearing Captain America stuff yeah I look at it and it motivates me like the, the reminder of the show the reminder of the character motivates me to be stronger to not quit to not give up to keep going so that's why I love wearing gear like this because it inspires me the shows inspire me the characters inspire me all that stuff inspires me to do my best to do better get better you know so uh, so yeah that's that's what I did I knocked it out uh, I was struggling there towards the end, but but I knocked it out and it was it was fantastic. So here I am and I'm on my way home and I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna get some rest. And then tonight is the 300th comic book podcast. So we're gonna do a lot of uh, comic book giveaways and we're gonna answer some questions, some nerdy questions, and some com probably a lot of comic book questions. So yeah, look forward to that. Uh, and I want to know uh, what is your favorite. What is your favorite comic book? For me, it's it's like that's a my favorite comic book is Saga. Actually, that's very easy, very easy. Saga is the best, but I get it in graphic novels, so I should say graphic novel. But like graphic novels, those are my favorite favorite graphic novels like of all time. Like I can't, I've tried it in issues and it's just too slow. But in graphic novel form, I love it. It's the best. So I want to know what your favorite comic is like you know could be like a comic line like the X-Men or, you know, the Avengers, whatever. So, yeah, um, that's it for now. Um, stay fit, stay healthy, stay nerdy, and love and peace.